And welcome to Mission Athletic Park in Kelowna. It's the BC Community Football Association Flag Football Championships. This is the U14 final. It is just underway. Cholak Giants and the Kelowna Goonies. Kelowna in the white with pink and black trim. Chilliwack Giants in the blue with white and red trim. They are defending the end zone to our broadcast right. Kelowna to our broadcast left. And we are underway. A 25-minute straight time game. Field is 40 yards total. Seven-yard end zones. Team scrimmage from their five-yard line. They've got three tries to get it to midfield. If they do, another set of downs to get in the end zone. Here's a quick pass on the right side. This one's complete. Flag is pulled on the Kelowna side of midfield. That'll be a first down for Chilliwack. Chilliwack's first possession of the football game. Quarterback Lincoln Boyd, number 10, hands this one off. Number two down the right sidelines. Nice gain there for Chilliwack. Quarterback Boyd comes over to the sideline. Chilliwack bench area, coaches just to our right, Kelowna just to our left. Second down for Chilliwack. They need about 12 yards to get into the end zone. Boyd looking to pass, short one, dumps it off to 83. Spins around just outside the five yard line and the flag is pulled there. So it is third down for Chilliwack. Chilliwack Giants Fawcett team in the blue and it's third down they need six yards to put it in the end zone or they will turn the ball over first possession of the football game quarterback back to pass under pressure throws it is complete touchdown Chilliwack Giants will go for the two-point convert. That means the ball comes back to the seven-yard. Check that 12-yard line. Normally, they would scrimmage from the five for a one-point convert. It comes back seven yards, and they will go for two. They're already up 6 nothing here early in this football game. Boyd rolls to his right. He's chased by 44. Throws, but it is incomplete. Quarterback was past the line, but the flag is waved off, and Chilliwack gets the opening points of the game. Putting the ball in the end zone, not able to get the convert. It is 6-0 Chilliwack. <laughs> so Kelowna's first opportunity with the football. Easton Giesbrick sends this one off to the right. Number 17. Able to haul that one in. Nice gain there, uh, about 12 yards. Again, teams start possessions from their five yard line. Three tries to get past midfield. If they do, another three tries to get it in the end zone. 25 minute game, it's intense, it's fast. Five players aside on the field. Second down, Easton Giesbrick, quarterback, throws short one. This one's complete and a good play there by Number nine for Chilliwack. Able to pull the flag down. It's about four yards short of the midfield stripe, so that brings up third down for Abbotsford. Or check that for Kelowna. See what the Goonies can do here. Third down, they need four. Here's a quick toss to the right. That one is complete. Flag is out. Number 17 on his man immediately to pull that flag. It was 17 for Kelowna who hauled in the pass, and it's first down for the Kelowna Goonies. Chilliwack opening scoring, scoring on its first possession of the game. Much smaller Kelowna team as we look at the five players on the field for the Goonies compared to Chilliwack. See if that size makes a difference in the game. Here's the quarterback, he's gonna throw in the end zone, he's got a man, it's complete, touchdown! Beautiful pass and catch for the Kelowna Goonies. And Kelowna has tied the game up at six. 
its first possession of the football game, and the Goonies are able to put it in the end zone. The strategy here with Chilliwack missing its two-point convert. Kelowna will go for the single-point convert and try to take the 7-6 lead. Quarterback throws in the end zone. It is good. So both offenses coming through and putting the ball in the end zone with their opening try. 7-6. Kelowna gets the single point convert to take the early lead. Chilliwack's second possession of the football game. Boyd throwing. Complete to number 12. Approaching midfield. Makes a move. Cuts to his left. His speed will get all the way around the outside. Down the sideline. Touchdown. Beautiful play there as the Chilliwack receiver caught the ball. And was able to cut to the left and use that speed. So the Giants going for a two-point convert. Boyd hands off to 12. 12 rolling to his right, now to his left. Looks like he may decide to run the football. Cuts to the left, into the end zone. And the two-point convert is good for Chilliwack. So 14-7 now the score in favor of Chilliwack. Giants have scored on both their possessions so far. Kelowna scored on its only possession. See if they can match what Chilliwack's just accomplished. Here's a pass. This one is complete. Approaching midfield. 17 has his flag pulled. But number 12 for Chilliwack. So second down coming up for Kelowna. The Goonies and Chilliwack Giants Fawcett team have worked themselves to the championship game here in the U14 division. Exciting flag football action, 25 minutes end to end. The Kelowna quarterback getting pressure, able to throw the ball away, and it's incomplete. Down the right sidelines, the antenna receiver just could not get high enough. The quarterback, uh, Easton Giesbrook, number 13, had uh, some pressure, so he had to get rid of the football quickly. Threw down the right sideline, but was not able to complete the pass. So now it is third down. Kelowna down 14-7. They need about six yards for a first down. Quarterback is pressured, throws. This one's complete. Number 14 brings that one in just on the Chilliwack side of midfield. So it's a new set of downs for Kelowna. First down for Kelowna. Giesbert, the quarterback, rolls to his right, short pass. This one's complete down the right sideline, 17. Gets a gain there of about eight on the play. It'll be second down for the Goonies. Again, teams get uh, three tries from their five yard line if they can get Pass midfield, a new set of downs, another three tries to put the ball in the end zone. Second down for Kelowna, pass to 14. Plenty of time, nobody forcing him. Now he's got an open man down the left side. It is incomplete, great play there by number 12 for Chilliwack as he came across and was able to knock the ball away at the last second. I'm not done the call. So third down coming up for Kelowna. They need about 13, 14 yards to get to the end zone. Quarterback is chased, he'll roll to his left. He's got time, throws, incomplete. And the flag is down as well as 14. Knew he maybe should have had that pass. The flag is down and we'll see what the call is here. Maybe interference against Chilliwack. We'll wait for the call officially. So it's an automatic first down for 
Kelowna. Ball just outside the five yard line. Interference, defensive interference was the call against the Chilliwack Giants Fawcett team. Chilliwack up 14 7. Kelowna looking to even things up here. Quarterback rolls to his left, but the flag is pulled just before he let go of the football. Big defensive play there by the Chilliwack Giants. That brings up second down. Second down for Kelowna. Pass to 14. Fakes to his right, fakes to his left. Now goes down the right side. Can he get to the end zone? No, close. I think he got down to about the one. Third down, and the ball is just outside that Chilliwack end zone. It is at the one-yard line. Great play there by Kelowna to complete the pass. Number 14 took it down the right sidelines. Looked like he might be able to make it in, but his flag was pulled at the one-yard line. So a big play here. Kelowna Goonies down 14-7. They're at the one-yard line. Quarterback looking to throw. Throws. It's incomplete. Flag was pulled. I'm not sure if it was pulled before he got the ball away, but regardless, Kelowna not able to put the ball in the end zone. So Chilliwack takes over up 14-7. Giants have scored on both their possessions so far. Boyd, the quarterback, throws off to the right. Short gain there for Chilliwack. It's the U14 championship game. We are about 10 minutes into this championship game, about 15 minutes to go. Second down for the Chilliwack Giants. Quarterback Boyd looks to throw to the left, but it's knocked away. Number three for Kelowna. Getting a hand on that one at the last second. Was able to knock the ball away and uh, should bring about third down, although the officials are chatting, three of them. So offside on the rushing team, so that's against Kelowna. So it's second down repeated, it's a five yard penalty, but they still need about eight yards to get to the first down. Second down for Chilliwack. Short toss to number two, this one is complete. And flag still not pulled, gets across midfield, so it's a first down for Chilliwack. Giants have scored on both their possessions so far, and because of that, they've got a 14-7 lead. Dale Corey with you here at Mission Athletic Park. It's the BC Community Football Association Flag Football Championships. York Dressler on the camera. We're proud to be bringing the games through VBN Sports. Here's Chilliwack, bleeded pass to number 48. Off to the right, and the flag is pulled. That'll bring up second down for Chilliwack. Second down coming up for the Giants. Still need about 12 yards to get to the end zone. Two plays to do it. Quarterback, short toss off to 48. Tries to spin just outside the five. Flag is pulled and that brings up third down. Ball placed at the six yard line. So one play for the Giants to get the ball in the end zone. Lincoln Boyd, number 10, the quarterback for Chilliwack. Six yards to pay dirt for the Giants. Up 14-7, rolls to his right. Flag is pulled before he gets the ball away. Big defensive play there by Kelowna's number 13. That's Easton Giesbrick, the quarterback, who comes up with a big play defensively. Stymies Chilliwack and holds them off the board with their third possession of the game. Can we also get all those people that are coaching on that side off, please? Uh, they're allowed to be behind the line. I'll make sure that they are. 13 minutes 
has gone so far in this football game, so just past the midway point. Kelowna starting from his five yard line. Handoff down the left side is number 14. Spins his way to a gain of about eight yards. Second down for the Kelowna Goonies. Trailing by touchdown, 14-7, the Chilliwack lead. Giants winners over Abbotsford earlier on this field to advance to the championship game. Looks like offside will be called against Chilliwack. So offside is against Kelowna. Five-yard penalty, repeat second down. But now a good 12 yards to go for the first down. Here's the throw, it is up and incomplete. Throw came back to the quarterback, number 13, Easton Giesbrick. Went up high, but a good defensive uh, play there by a couple of Giants players to get in the way, knock the ball down. And it is now third down for Kelowna. Third down and a long ways to go. About 12 yards for a first down. Quarterback rolling to his right, looking to throw, pulls up, throws it deep, it is incomplete. So it'll be a turnover. The Kelowna Goonies could not move the football, advancing it past midfield, and so they will turn the ball over. It's now Chilliwack football. Kelowna late in getting some players on the field, but they do get them there in time. Here's a quick completion down the left sideline. Cuts back to the right, number 12. He's got some great moves there in speed. And is able to get a gain of about 10 yards. So second and about five for Chilliwack to try to get to midfield and get a new set of downs. And a beautiful catch there by number nine for Chilliwack on second down. Gain of about 22 yards on the play. And that'll move the ball deep into Kelowna territory. Nine minutes to go here in this football game. It's the U14 championship game. Chilliwack Giants with a 14-7 lead over the Kelowna Goonies. Chilliwack threatening to put more points in the board. Ball at about the nine yard line. Quarterback rolls to the right. Complete touchdown. Boyd completing that one to the right side, number 12, hauling it in. And Chilliwack's now taking a two touchdown lead in this U14 championship game. Going for a two point convert. It's 20 to seven at the moment. Hand off to number 12. Fakes to the left, fakes to his right. Now looks like he might throw it. Pulls up, throws it, complete. And the convert is good. Man wide open in the left corner of the end zone. Great pass by number 12. 22 seven. Thank you. I thought that was mine. 22 seven coaches. Thank you. 22-7. 22-7, yeah. So 22 to 7 the score in favor of Chilliwack. Two touchdown lead for the Giants. About eight minutes left in this 25 minute straight time game. It's the U14 championship game. Kelowna needs some points. Quarterback airing this one out long. It's complete. Down the right sideline he goes and a great defensive play there by number two for Chilliwack to pull the flag out before the Kelowna player got in the end zone. Long pass completion there of close to 30 yards. And that takes the ball deep into Chilliwack territory. Ball at about the seven yard line. 
Kelowna down 22-7. Needs some points here. Quarterback Easton Giesberg throws to the right. This one's complete to number three in the end zone. Touchdown! So a decision made by the coaches here on the sideline to get two. You're going to go for a two-point convert here. The touchdown is good. That makes it a 22-13 game. Big play here for Kelowna, getting back to within one major score. See if they can get the two-point convert. Giesbert, back to pass, throws it deep, and it's into the fans in behind the end zone. Flag went down in play as well. So turnover there. Chilliwack takes control of the football. Quarterback. <laughs> Completion down the sidelines right in front of us. York should have got a good shot of that one. <laughs> Didn't know what way to go there. Nine point difference. So it is a completion down in front of the camera here. Chilliwack able to move the football. Here's a handoff to number two. Big defensive play by 44 for Kelowna. As, two, as soon as two got the football, flag was pulled, so not much of a gain there for Chilliwack. So third down coming up for Chilliwack, up 22-13 in this U14 championship game. Takes one hand off to one way, then the other side. Boyd throws, complete. Man wide open, it's number 48, and he's got the ball in Kelowna territory. And the Chilliwack Giants will be able to move the yardsticks. Figuratively speaking, of course. Uh, is the commissioner dealing with uh, all that? You start from your five, you get three chances to get a first down, get the ball past midfield, then you get another three to put in the end zone. And Chilliwack successful there, big gain. <laughs> And the Giants able to move the football into Kelowna territory. Three minutes left in the game. Here's the completion for Chilliwack, 48, and he is caught just outside the five-yard line. It's a two-possession game right now with a score 22-13, a nine-point difference. Chilliwack in the lead. Kelowna... Really needs a stop here to get back in the game. Go guys. Don't force it. Don't force anything. Jay, where is your clock? Your clock is in the Football about the six yard line. Boyd gets it. Hands it off to the left. Here's number 12. Gets to the outside, inside the five yard line. And at about the four and a half yard line is where number 12 is stopped for Chilliwack. And it'll be third down. Big third down play coming up here. Kelowna needs a defensive stop. Big third down play coming up. Chilliwack ahead, 22-13. Ball just inside the five. Boy, throws the end zone. It is complete. Touchdown for Chilliwack. Chilliwack Giants Fawcett team takes a two touchdown lead. We are in the late stages, about two minutes to go in this U14 championship game. Giants open a 6 0 lead. Kelowna came back with a touchdown in its first possession, got the convert to go ahead 17 6. Chilliwack with a pair of touchdowns to go ahead 22 7. Kelowna 
Got one back to make it 22-13. Missed the two-point convert, though. And now Chilliwack for the single convert. Boyd rolls to his right, throws in the end zone. It is complete. And the convert is good, and that gives Chilliwack a 29-13 lead. Yeah, you're a D, man. Let's go, dog. Hey, real D. Hey, hey. Real soft. Real soft. So time a factor now for Kelowna. They need three scores, and there's not much time left. Under two in the game. First down from the Kelowna five-yard line. Quarterback Easton Giesbrick, number 13, should be the last play of the game. Completed to number 17, up around midfield. The flag is pulled, the game is over, and the Chilliwag Giants Fawcett team has won the U14 Provincial Flag Football Championships here in Kelowna. Chilliwag Giants running the board. Three straight wins in this championship round to take the title here in the U14 division. A great football game, went back and forth. Again, Chilliwack up 6-0 early in the first possession. Kelowna came back on its first time with the ball to get a converted touchdown, go ahead 7-6, but after that it was all Chilliwack, 14-7, then 22-7. Kelowna got a touchdown back to make it 22-13, and then Chilliwack scores that touchdown right at the end of the game. 29-13, the final score. Chilliwack Giants have defeated the Kelowna Goonies to capture the U14 BC Flag Football Championships here at Mission Athletic Park in Kelowna, site of the BC Community Football Association Provincial Flag Football Championships. Congratulations again to the coaches and players from the Chilliwack Giants Fawcett team winning the U14 Provincial Flag Football Championship. The vice president will be presenting the bronze medals to the Knights. Yes. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, thank you all again. And the gold team gets a banner as well. That's one of those